Okay, guys, today we have a bit of a different feel because you're not going to see my face for this how to, but I want to show you guys how you can make a quick, easy short with Canva. And this is going to be easy. We're just going to click mobile video and wait for this to load. Now, when you're on the website, your computer probably will load this faster than mine because of the processor that you have in your own computer. It's probably not Pentium, but you can do this with pretty well any device that you have access to, whether that be a tablet, a phone, um, laptop. I'm doing this on laptop for the sake of ease of recording. <coughs> so we got the templates and styles now loading in at least. And with this being said, we're going to actually close off the home tab because we don't need it. Not anymore. That's all we needed for was to pull up this. So, let's say we want to make a Halloween. Uh, short. Because Halloween is coming, right? So, let's do this. Actually, I like that. Freakiness. Right here. So now you can click right and play. Now we can take our text, drag it. You can even change your colors too, guys. Like, say you want it to be red, we can change that to red. Uh, we can find a better font, I'm sure. We want horror. And on the back here, we're going to delete because that's not working out because it's a watermark, right? So they want us to use pro mode for that, so we won't use that because this is going to be entirely done for free on the free basis. So here's where we can really get creative. Black and white. Now we're just going to search black and white because it's a Halloween short, but this doesn't take a whole lot of time or effort, guys. Um, let's get a black flower, actually. I like that. So now we should be able to pull up graphics here. And when it loads, we will pick some graphics, drag and drop, arrange, and you'll see just kind of how easy this works, guys. It's actually quite user-friendly. You can do a lot with this app, but this is just one of the many uses. I really wish that um, my computer could process this information a lot faster online, because honestly, that's mainly my CPU, guys. It's not actually the website or my internet. It would be more so that. Here, let's use these. I like roses. Roses are one of my favorite flowers, so we'll use roses. We're going to scale this up. We're going to move the text up a bit so it can be red. We're going to take the background to this image. We're going to hit the color. And let's change it to something a little more appropriate. Let's go grayscale. Yeah, I like that. Now, something you can also do is go into gradients. We want something like that. But we want um, to change the direction. I forget how you do that. I think background color. Oh, we already did. So let's make this a different color so it pops a little better. And we're going to go edit photo. And this is where you can really just make your own designs for everything, guys. It's just so nice. 
so we're going to take some effects here. Uh, we're going to... Actually, maybe we'll filter it. Because filters change a few things. So, what if we went Skiendi? Okay, Nordic. Oh, here we go. We're wanting the color pop. So what if we go minty? Maybe minty will be better. Now with that background, but I do like how that pops out, so we're going to change the background color again. Just because I don't like it anymore. So we're going to click on the background color, and let's try this instead, or maybe this. There we go. And to add to the Halloween element, 